Hello healers, welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new. This is your week ahead reading where I add a simple reading with three cards representing the full week. The first card is Monday, Tuesday, the second is Wednesday, Thursday, and the last is the weekend, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. So we will have again a pick a card, so we have more options here for you. This is going to be group one, two, and three. These are full tarot decks and we will shuffle here together and just get the, the cards and the energy of the week ahead, okay? This is just to have an idea, an energy of what to come or what to avoid for you. So I hope this helps you out in some way. Like always, my details, the cards that I use, a way for you to support this channel, everything in the description below. And if you're not yet, consider subscribing. There are many videos here for you. I add week ahead readings every Saturday. Uh, yes or no bigger cards every Monday. There's lives as much as possible. Whenever it's possible, I jump in and I do readings live for you. So if you are subscribed, you'll know when I come live so you get a notification. So make sure you subscribe if you're not yet. And if you're coming back to my channel, thanks very much for your support. I'm really grateful that you're here with me. And I hope this video helps you out. And if it does, leave me a comment. Let me know if it resonates in some way. You know, I'm always happy to hear from you. So again, guys, group one, two, and three. Timestamp below. Thanks for watching. Group number one, if you choose this beautiful deck here, what is the week ahead for you? Monday, Tuesday, group one. Monday, Tuesday. Wednesday, Thursday. I feel like this is trying to come out. Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Okay. I will get one extra card at the end, okay? Just an oracle card. I feel like getting one extra card too. So Monday, Tuesday, straight away here. Guys, this is the Eight of Swords, okay? The beginning of the week here, guys, a little bit is stuck. You can see like she's stuck in a bubble, okay? It's like uh, feeling a little bit stuck in a situation, okay? So it could be work, relationship, you know, what, like always take what resonates. Maybe you will feel a little bit stuck in the beginning of the week, having to do something maybe that you don't want to, a little bit of stress, but this is really a perspective, okay, guys? This is like feeling stuck when you're not really. Like you can see here, she is stuck like in a bubble. She's like feeling like that, but it's not really the case, okay? This is like a situation that you needed to maybe see from a different perspective to really analyze. Maybe it's just the way that you per perceive the situation. Maybe it's the way you're seeing yourself stuck, but it's not really the case, okay? Maybe it's some stress and negativity that you needed to focus here and recenter your focus on what really matters, what really is serving you, maybe cutting away situations that is not serving you okay so pay attention to that energy at the beginning of the week okay guys so maybe something there is just a perspective that needs to be changed your focus need to shift to the positivity to you know seeing the the good things okay the lessons with whatever is happening with you okay so pay attention at the beginning of the week so wednesday thursday we have here you can see the moon okay interesting here with the moon because i feel like with this introspective uh, beginning of the week here if you really start to focus on you and seeing why you're feeling the way that you may be starting the week there is a, a chance here to bring things to the surface okay maybe realizing okay realizations here of how you're actually feeling and um really trying to understand here why things are happening uh, for you okay there's some light that will be put on to some area of your life that will start to analyze and realize what you actually want here okay so it could be any area guys that you're trying to focus now or manifest i feel like if you do focus here like i said on the positive side of things and i feel like you will be able to see more of uh, why negativity is happening why certain things are bothering you okay like remember guys it could be career relationships family whatever you're trying to focus right now okay so i feel like if you dig deep here guys you can get out of the situation when you focus you know on what you actually want here and what is bothering you okay things will come out to the surface here and you have to deal with them right so i feel like uh, middle of the week you have a chance to have some kind of realization bringing you know uh, maybe dreams that are sleeping you know situations secrets things coming to life okay so pay attention to that guys because maybe it's a chance for you to deal with things that could be bothering you and you didn't even uh, realize why but if you when you focus here like you're feeling stuck and you wanted to get out of that bubble it really focus on you halfway through the week here i feel like things will be discovered here okay it could be internal wisdom coming back here to you okay and uh, it could be a situation like 
communicating with others okay so maybe you are communicating and you're bringing more um into the situation that you are right now so you can communicate more and understand it. again dealing with this okay feel like halfway through the week pay attention because things will come to surface okay and you'll have to deal with that and the friday saturday sunday the weekend here we have the queen of wands okay which is a lovely energy here i feel like it's a switch because you can see here it's a bit of a cold energy in a way in the beginning of the week a little bit of negativity i feel like you confront yourself you deal with the, with the situation whether it's with you or even if there's someone else involved and by the weekend here the queen of wands i feel like you're getting back your power okay you're trusting your intuition you're trusting what is happening and you're connecting with your yourself with your passions again you can see here the red the beautiful uh, fire colors here and you can see here the fire coming back into your life okay i feel like connected with your creativity again um, maybe your passions it could be someone or it could be your career okay it could be the things that you like to do your creativity coming back to you so i feel like the, the weekend they will really be connected with yourself i feel like you switch very much the energy here it's a bit cold in the beginning of the week stuck and by the weekend you can see here the fire is coming back into your life the fire is coming back into this relationship or the situation that you're dealing with okay guys so i feel like this weekend can finish really well i feel like if you focus like i said you will focus on getting out of this stuck situation here and the the mind frame maybe switching here the focus okay dealing with the things that will come to the surface halfway through the week and you can end this weekend here you know the friday saturday sunday really focus on you trusting your intuition again bringing back the fire okay whether it's the relationship career anything that you're trying to focus i feel like you're starting to manifest things and bring things more into a balance here okay more stable i feel like more stability here definitely the fire coming back into your life okay definitely uh, realizing here what you want and connecting with your intuition sorry guys i'm just editing and i wanted to add a, a bit of the cards okay i don't want to um leave you without an extra card so just in case it helps you out any kind of advice here from the the fairies okay i don't have here music listen carefully for there may be messages in the music you hear music can lift your soul rekindle memories and charm fairies to your door interesting here guys and uh, you can see here music okay it's just an extra card here for an advice or an idea for you to do something here and we have music okay so it's just uh, maybe for you to focus on the music here and uh, something that can help you out to maybe uh especially i feel like in the middle of the week here if you wanted to meditate and try to understand what's coming what's happening for you okay when you try to deal with uh, whatever is going to happen in the middle of the week i feel like putting some music meditating a little bit can help you out okay just to give you an idea here i wanted to add an extra card here to help you out in any kind of guidance okay something for you to do so that's what i have here guys i feel like um uh, this can be a beautiful week here for you, okay? It's a bit of ups and downs, so be prepared to deal with this. Maybe meditate a bit with music, can help you out. And uh, I feel like at the, the end of the week, you really finish well here, really connected with yourself, okay? That's what I have here for your group one. I hope this helps you out. As always, let me know if it does, leave me a comment, and I wish you a lovely week. Thanks very much for watching. Group number two, if you chose this beautiful deck here. And they choose the group two. Okay. Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Okay, and I'll get that extra card in a bit. Okay, so straight away here, guys. Monday, Tuesday, six, eight of cups. Okay, so straight away you can see here that uh, the beginning of the week, guys. I feel like you make a decision. Okay, I feel like you start the week making decisions. Really focus here on your heart what you really want and you're walking away from something okay you leave something behind guys that uh, maybe it's not easy to leave behind maybe something that you have been thinking about and there's just a decision you finally focus here on the light you can see here like the light at the end and you're like moving moving forward and wanting to go for something better okay i feel like this is a decision that is emotional as well and it's not uh, the easiest but you really come to a conclusion the beginning of the week of what you wanted to do here guys it could be relationship it could be career okay anything family something that you're trying to focus it could be just uh, an attitude something that you really decided to change about uh, your mind your body something that you focus on to really change in your life okay so this is really some kind of decision guys and i feel like is something that uh, will help you out to grow and uh, you're actually moving here towards something better and uh, really connecting with your heart and uh, 
moving forward, okay? This is an interesting beginning of the week here for you guys. So pay attention to that. There's an important decision here for you, beginning of the week. You're walking away from something, okay? You're leaving something behind, but you know your focus on what you want here. And uh, halfway through the week, we have here the Magician. Okay, Wednesday, Thursday, Magician. Well, it's been very interesting here because I feel like after leaving this behind, whatever decision you make or something that you wanted to really do with your life, changing something here, the magician is starting to happen. So I feel like you're starting to realize your own power, your own abilities to bring things into your reality, to manifest things that you want, to really focus with uh, your own life, your own things that you want here. I feel like you realize that you actually have all the tools in your hand and you can manifest things, okay? You can focus on what you want and you can be this magician. So I feel like halfway through the week, you, you bring your power back, okay? I feel like you're really happy with this decision, whatever that is, okay? Leaving something behind. And I feel like you connect again with yourself, trying to understand and I feel like you're starting to understand what you really want and manifesting here the things. I feel like you realize your power here, guys. I feel like you, you, you're getting to understand here everything that you have to offer, everything that you can do with your life. And I feel like this is a, a beautiful focus here for you, okay? So pay attention to that, guys. It's interesting here. You can really start to manifest things into your life or understand the power that you have to do it, okay? And Friday, Saturday, Sunday... We have here, beautiful, the Two of Cups, okay? So the weekend here, guys, you can see the connection again, right? And this is an emotional connection here. It could be relationships. It could be a partnership with uh, someone business-related. Or it could be just finally that idea. It's like you finally click on your mind what you wanted to do. And this is uh, regarding, like, your emotions, okay? Uh, something that you really love and um, that it's emotionally fulfilled here. This is a beautiful connection, guys. After this week here, I feel like after deciding here to leave something behind, uh, realizing the power that you have, I feel like this is the click, that final connection here that you need to really realize your power, to realize that things, you made the right decision, that you really wanted to, fo to go forward here in your life, okay? This is like a beautiful connection, guys. So the weekend here, if there's a communication that uh, maybe you're waiting or you're trying with someone or a communication that you really need to make with your family, okay, anything that you're trying to manifest here, guys, I feel like this is like starting here uh, big time, okay? Like that is the communication, the connection, it's here. Okay, the weekend is really, I feel, a chance as well for you to finally come forward and... Um, talk to people. I feel like this is really an emotional weekend here for you too. So be prepared here. I feel like uh, this realization here of your power is very important and will be really helpful for you. Okay. But remember here, guys, you are leaving something behind. You're making a decision here at the beginning of the week. Okay. And it's an important one because it's moving forward, growing, going to the, towards the light, the decision. Okay. The light that your heart is connected with. So you connect here and you realize your power again. You have all the tools you need. Remember that, okay, guys? And also this connection here. Like I say, it could be with someone else. could be just you with your mind, okay? But definitely a beautiful connection here, guys. You can see here the hands. But it could be you and your mind. You realizing your own power. It could be you with someone else as well, okay? So, you know, like I like always, guys, take, guys takes what resonates, okay? But this is an emotional weekend here, something that's really beautiful here. I do want to add extra cards here from the, the fairy oracle. I wanted to, to add it here. Wow. You can see here, guys, abundance, okay? If there is any doubt here in the beginning of this week that um, you, why are you walking away from something, okay? If you're a bit worried whether it's money or whether it's the right decision, okay? You do have abundance here, okay, guys, waiting for you. Prepare yourself for incoming abundance. Release any mental blocks you may have in fairy land. In human land, there is enough abundance for everyone. Wow, this is really, I feel, confirming here, guys, that you are in the right direction, okay? If there is any doubts or fears at the beginning of the week of this decision you have to make, I feel like you, you can release that because, like, realizing your power again, connecting again, okay, with someone, with your ideas, with, the, with that need to reconnect here, Okay, and the abundance is here, just confirming that you will get abundance. Abundance is, is on your way here. Okay, you're on the right decision. Um, you're already on the right um, direction here. Okay, you made the right decision here at the beginning of the week. So pay attention to that, guys, because I feel like this really will play very important here this week for you. It could be very interesting here, the, the changes in your life, and it's for the better. Okay, this is abundance here, it's just to confirm to you, you're on the right path. Okay, whether it's fierce or not. Here, because I know it's not always easy to leave something behind, but it's just to confirm to you, you'll be on the right path here. Abundance is waiting for you, okay? 
That's what I have here for you, group two. I feel like it's an important week for you. So pay attention there, especially at the beginning of the week when that decision is made. And uh, don't forget that abundance is here waiting for you and you don't need to fear anything. Okay? I hope this helps you out. And if it does, like always, let me know. Leave me a comment. And I wish you a lovely week. Thanks for watching. Group number three, if you chose this beautiful deck, what is the week ahead holding for you? Okay, Monday, Tuesday, group three, week ahead. This one is coming, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, group three, go ahead. Okay. And I'll get one extra card here at the end from the Oracle card, okay? Monday, Tuesday here, guys, straight away, strength. Lovely, okay? Starting the week here, guys, realizing or in need to use your strength, okay? So pay attention there. Anything that's happening to you, whether it's family, career, relationship, there's a need for inner strength here, okay? And this strength is not uh, really fight or showing that uh, you are strong. It's really that inner strength, okay? It's using strength with love. So pay attention there, guys, if there's communications, if there's a need to talk to someone, if there's a need to really show how you feel. Just remember that you do have this strength already, okay? You are stronger than you realize. It's just like to confirm to you, you can use this strength with love. So if there's communication, if there's someone involved, if there's maybe just something that you need to realize yourself here to maybe go to the next step of the things you are doing in your life, okay? The day-to-day -day life there, beginning of the week, maybe you're a bit tired as well. You know what's going on there, guys. Just to, to remind you here, you have this inner strength, okay? You may need to use it. Remember, it's an inner strength, okay? Strength with love. And remember here, you are stronger than you realize. Wednesday, Thursday here, guys, we do have the two of cups. Oh, well, that's lovely because it does show this connection, okay, guys? You can see here like a lover's connection, but it could be a business, someone talking to you, okay, giving you ideas. It could be you connecting with uh, your mind, okay, clicking with your creativity as well. But this is a connection, okay, guys? So if you are um, disconnected from someone, if you're not communicating, I feel like halfway through the week, have a chance. But it's like a chance for you. Like I said, it could be career. It could be you communicating with someone else, organizing things in your life. But this is a communication. This is a connection, okay? It's an important connection here that will help you out. And it's emotionally fulfilling as well. No doubt a connection there that will really help you out, okay? So like I said, it could be love. It could be a career. It could be just you connecting with you, okay? Finally. But I feel like more in connection with someone else communicating. So pay attention there on the chance of halfway through the week to communicate with someone, okay? And Friday, Saturday, Sunday, guys, we do have here the Eight of Pentacles. You can see here, this is really representing some hard work, okay? Put into something. And I feel like it's connected with you, okay? Because I feel like you Using your inner strength here, you're making this connection halfway through the week. Whether this is love, career, or family, you are going to put some work here into this, okay? I feel like it's connected here with this connection that will happen halfway through the week. So I feel like uh, together with someone else, okay, you're starting here to put some hard work into something. It could be your idea, it could be your next step, something you're trying to manifest for a while. So this is happening here, okay guys? Straight away, I feel like you're not stopping. You are working hard through the weekend with your ideas, maybe writing things down, okay, organizing, but you are working hard here and you will start to, to see, okay guys, the results of this hard labor here. So I feel like um, this is a busy weekend for you. If I feel like you're starting more introspective, okay? Realizing your inner strength making this connection halfway through the week. And it could be, like I said, emotional and uh, fulfilling for some of you. And uh, it could be with someone else. I don't feel like it's someone else here, it, even if it's not love, but it is for many of you, okay? If you're not uh, connecting with someone, it's the chance to reconnect, but you will start to work towards this connection, okay? And this idea, this, this job, this career, this connection here, will be the hard work here on the weekend, okay? So I feel like together with someone else, you're not doing this alone, I don't feel like, okay? But it's hard work here put into this situation straight away, but already seeing some results. So it's a good thing, okay? It's a beautiful connection that uh, will result into some hard work, but will be beneficial, okay? You will be happy with the results of this hard work. And I do want to add here extra cards here from the fairies as well, if they have any advice, anything for us, okay? And we have here transformation and the message is this fairy tells you to surrender to a transformation in your life that's happening for your highest good embrace a transformation the best is yet to come 
I feel like this is really beautiful here connected with this week because I feel like this connection here, guys, if it could be like it's finally a reconnection here with someone. It's finally the idea. It's finally something that maybe you're waiting for a while. So I feel like there was inner strength here that was needed. Maybe to connect again. Maybe to communicate again. Maybe to have the courage. But this will result into hard labor. But remember, it's a transformation that will be beneficial for you. It's something that you will be happy in the long run. Okay? The best is yet to come. So I feel like you're just starting to hard work here into this straight away you don't waste any time but there's a transformation here okay this is a good thing that you're investing your time on and remember it it's like uh, the best is yet to come okay you just put in the hard labor now but you will see the results okay that's what i see here for your group three an interesting week here for you pay attention to this connection that you shouldn't miss okay because there's a chance here for transformation in your life bringing something good finally back into your life okay finally manifestation here for you okay that's what i see here group three let me know if this helps you out and resonating anyway and as always i wish you a lovely week thanks for watching